Are you looking to start selling digital products on Shopify? If so, in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you just that. Keep on watching. Real quick, before I move on with today's tutorial, I want to share with you some digital product ideas for you to consider. First on my list is going to be PDFs. You can create and sell travel guides, best places to visit in a specific country, state, or city, checklists, how-to guides, planners, recipes, and templates. Then there's digital art. You can do things like logos and wallpapers. Now my ultimate favorite is going to be ebooks. You can pretty much brain dump your knowledge into an ebook and sell it. A hot selling ebook would include a solution to someone's problem. Quora is a good place to start where people are always asking questions on there and you can easily create an ebook solving their problem and target them as a customer. Next is going to be courses. Create a course teaching what you're good at. These do extremely well with proper marketing. Real quick, if you would like access to 20,000 PLR products that you can edit, rebrand, sell, and keep 100% of the profits, make sure you click the link pinned in the comments. I also created a video showing you how to rebrand ebooks. I will link it up top and also in the description of this video. Now that we got that out the way, let's move on with today's tutorial. To start selling your digital products on Shopify, you first need to sign up with Shopify. Link will be in the description. Once you're all signed up, you'll be brought up to your dashboard which looks like this. I recommend you knock out these few essential steps before you do anything else. First on my list is going to be to pick a plan. So if you click on pick a plan, as you can see, you can start off right now for just $1 for your first 3 months. Then after that, $79, you got $299. Th these packages you do not need. For selling digital products, the basic is more than enough. Next, you're going to want to go right here to settings and you're going to want to go to payments and you want to set up your payments. All right. You want to connect your PayPal, all that stuff. You may want to activate Shopify payments. So once you get that stuff out the way, the next step is going to be to go right here where it says online store right under themes. You want to go right here where it says customize. All right. So once you're on this page, you pretty much want to customize your store. All right. It's real simple. Drag and drop plug and play. So once you got all that stuff out the way, you picked your plan, you set up your payments, and you customize your theme, now what you're going to want to do is right here on your dashboard, go right here where it says apps. Just scroll down a little bit until you see Shopify App Store. Click on that. And right here in the search bar, you want to type in digital downloads. Once this pops up, this is the one you want right here. The black arrow with the cloud, just click on that. With digital downloads, you can upload your digital products that you want to sell. I highly recommend them for your Shopify digital product business. All you're going to want to do is click on add app and then you're going to want to click on install app. So now that you install the app, what you want to do is right here on this page, just click on add new product. Once again, click on add your products and right here you can pretty much add your first digital product. Okay. So I'm just going to type in an ebook master YouTube influence right here. You want to make sure you give a well descriptive description. All right for your product. That's a good enough description. Now if we scroll down to media, just leave it like that for right now. You can leave pricing like that for right now. And all we're going to do is click on save. So once you click on save right here where it says product status, click on that little arrow and click on draft and you want to click on save. Now once you save that right here where it says more actions, click on that and you're going to have this button here that says add digital file. Click on that right here where it says add a file. Just click on it, locate your digital product, click on open. And as you can see, the digital product is uploaded. All right. It is a PDF. So once you're done there, all you have to do is click on publish. So right here, it says this product includes a physical component. Orders will be marked as unfulfilled and admin until you fulfill the physical component. This is not a physical component. So what we're going to do is go right back over here to products. Click on master YouTube influence. And what we're going to do is toggle that off. You want to price your digital product. So I'm just going to put $10. We can put compare price uh, 15. We're not going to track quantity. It's not a physical product. It's a digital product. So make sure you toggle that and we're going to want to add some images. All right. So click on add files right here. You can add your media. I mean, if you have multiple images, you can add them as well. And once you're done, right, you can click on save. So now that you uploaded your images, if you want to preview how your store will look with your digital product, all you have to do is click on preview. So that's pretty much how it's going to look. We have the description right here. We have the add to cart buy now button. We have the image. Now, if you're going to be selling eBooks, I highly recommend you use mockups. You can go on a website like place it place. It is pretty much the go-to for all your mockups. All you have to type in is ebook covers mockups 
and right here you're gonna get a bunch of mockups pretty much at your fingertips all right so i will leave a link to place it in the description so that way you can get access to place it if you want to sell courses i highly recommend you check out these apps the first on my list is going to be thinkific all right so it is an app so all you have to do is go on the app store just go back here to your shopify dashboard click on apps and you want to search for this app all right so the first one is thinkific online courses you can pretty much do it all create and sell online courses to grow your business all that fun stuff right here is the pricing free then you got basic start and then grow all right next on my list is going to be courses and memberships okay so 24 dollars a month you get a 14 day free trial um you can pretty much do it all on here right you can create and sell digital products on your online store so definitely check them out if this is something you're looking into right if it's selling online courses you can also sell your digital products that could be your templates that could be your ebooks whatever you pretty much want to sell as a digital product you can use this platform here courses and memberships now the next on my list is going to be courses plus they do have a free plan available and you can turn your store into an online course platform all right so create and sell your online courses provide tests and exams with quizzes monitor customers progress and quiz scores so on and so forth right they do have a demo free up to five lessons per store course progress tracking courses app branding all that good stuff and for the basic plan it starts at $29.99 a month all right so i highly recommend you guys check that out if you want to start uploading courses as your digital product on your shopify store definitely check out these three all right recap courses plus courses and memberships and being kiffic all right so now that i got that out the way i want to share with you some amazing resources that'll help you out on your digital product journey first resource on my list is going to be designer.io with designer you can create your lead magnets ebooks etc you can even import blog posts and turn those into ebooks i created a video on that i will link it up top and also in the description of this video next resource on my list is going to be canva with canva you can create a lot of your digital products to sell online next is going to be glorify with glorify it is the ultimate design tool for e-commerce entrepreneurs you can knock out your digital products on here as well next is going to be pinterest with pinterest you can use it as an amazing resource to get ideas for your digital products next is going to be etsy etsy is an amazing resource to get ideas and get inspired for your digital products next is going to be pexels with pexels you can use this to get all your free stock photos royalty free images and videos so definitely check out pexels next is going to be beacons once you got your store all decked out and got your digital products up for sale i recommend beacons which is an amazing link in bio tool that you can use edit add your digital products to and use the unique link they give you to add into your bio of your social media accounts that pretty much wraps things up for this video if you found some value in this video consider liking and subscribing it really does help my channel and i really do appreciate the support now at this point of the video you're probably asking hey melvin how can i create and sell ebooks online and that is why your next step should be to watch this video right here where i share with you just that and as always never stop the hustle i'll see you in the next video